Pula is the largest city in Istria, and it is known for its many ancient Roman buildings, the most famous of which is its first century amphitheater, which is among the six largest Roman arenas in the world. This is one of the best preserved amphitheaters from antiquity and is still in use today. Though it did host the gladiators' fights in the past, today it primarily serves as an incredible stage for various cultural events. It features some of the most famous music stars, performing musicals, performances and a special experience during the Pula Film Festival. In the premises below the arena itself, there is a museum where one can see various interesting exhibitions from the ancient times. Settled in the prehistoric era and valued for its strategic location, Pula has been occupied, destroyed and rebuilt numerous times. The Romans, Venetians, Austro-Hungarian monarchy, as well as the Allied forces in World War II have each administered the city. In year 45 BC, the city was ruled by the Romans and already had 30,000 inhabitants at that time. This is approximately the time when numerous important constructions began, waterworks, sewerage and numerous buildings that, to this day, witness the magnificence of this city. Arch of the Sergi is an ancient Roman triumphal arch at the very entrance to the main street of the city. It was built in the first century in memory of the three brothers of the Sergi family. One of them, Lucius Sergi Lepid, was a tribune in the Roman legion. The low relief on the frieze represents a scene with the war chariot drawn by horses. At the end of the street is the central city square, or Forum, and the Temple of Augustus. It was built in the first century and dedicated to the first Roman Emperor Augustus. In it you can see stone and bronze Roman antique sculptures. The Pula Market was opened in 1903 and was very popular at the time due to use of new materials, such as iron and glass. The Historic and Maritime Museum of Istria is located on the castle above the town. There are over 50,000 items within 18 museum collections. A breathtaking view of the city can be best observed from the top of the castle, or Kastel in local language. One of the more recent attractions is the Aquarium Complex, located in the 130-year-old Fort Verudella. Today, the aquarium hosts more than 100 species of fish from the Adriatic Sea and over 50 species of tropical fish, as well as fish from rivers and lakes. It also serves as recovery for rescued and injured sea animals. There are two very safe and comfortable marinas in the city that will provide safe berth for yachts and sailboats of all sizes. One is located in the very city center next to the arena and the other one in Verudela Bay. Just a few kilometers from the city center, there is an international airport, which will allow you to travel quickly and comfortably to this part of Croatia. The Briuni Islands National Park is just six kilometers away from Pula, and it is one of the most attractive tourist attractions in Croatia. This archipelago consists of a group of islands of the western coast of Istria, which together with the surrounding waters was proclaimed a national park in 1983. With each year, Briuni is becoming an ever more desired and visited destination for yachtsmen, who love to spend a few days on the island enjoying the amazing beauties of nature and everything that's on offer. The island can also be explored by sitting back and riding the tourist train. And there really is lots to see. Stay safe and visit official Croatian National Tourist Board website for all most relevant travel and safety information.